It is that moment that we have been waiting for. I'm ready. Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tere, and we are going to be reacting and reviewing Banks' new album. It's either three or tally marks. I, I, I call it three, but I, I haven't watched any videos on this. I haven't... Literally, I am subscribed on Facebook to a group and I have not looked at it. A lot of people have been being like, oh, this album is, uh, or oh, this album's good, or this song is, uh, and I'm like, wait, hold up, pause. I gotta go look at this myself because I am ready. I would, I have wanted to react to Banks' album for a while going to do a review for the altar but I was too scared to and I was like who wants to watch me on YouTube so I just let the my nerves get the best of me and I never even uploaded never decided to but I am not gonna let my nerves get the best of me Banks deserves the recognition she deserves to be applauded for all the songs that she has put out before and for this new record because I feel like I have a high expectation but I don't because Banks is a bad bitch all by herself. I feel like the more I listen to her albums from Goddess to The Altar to this album, she has progressed from somebody who is very... I believe I watched the first um, interview on her. She was like, very, very soft spoken, very, you know. And then I see her on the gimme behind the scenes, her directing the camera, this is what I want, you dancers dance. I was like, whoa, whoa. I, I feel like she's finally becoming who she was meant to be. And I love it. I'm here for it. I'm ready to review this album. Ooh. So, without further ado, track one. Oh God, help me, help me, help me, help me, God. I have my water here just in case I get dehydrated. <laughs> Start this over. I have to start this over. I can't. <laughs> I feel like I just went through puberty, a sexual awakening, and then I I need to pee. What the fuck is that? <laughs> okay, okay, we're getting through this. We're getting through this, Trey. <laughs> I may have to take off my sweatshirt. I got my water here. I got my snacks just in case I get lost in this album. I can't find my way out. Oh, God. What are you doing to my speakers? One minute to digest. Uh, I'll be back. Um, holy fuck. I'm back. What the fuck was that? <laughs> wow. The production on that and uh, and I'll let you push me around until that till now oh. 
so that one's a bop. We're gonna keep that one. I don't know what the fuck. If she damaged my speakers, can I get reimbursed? Anyway. That one's a bop. We're keeping that. All right. <laughs> like what from the ground? <laughs> this song gets me so freaking tight. I can't. And then we go into this part. Oh. <laughs> and my favorite part. <laughs> so I was very happy about like the promotion of this album because I don't know if anybody caught probably. Um, Apple Music did like a whole segment on her promoting Gimme, which it was like on like new music coming out uh, on that playlist for Apple Music and stuff. That made me so freaking happy because I feel like the production and like, or not production, but more promotion of her is what's needed. Not that we don't find her, but like a lot of people don't even know who Banks is. And I'm like, She's had two albums, bro. Catch up. But, whoo! This, that's my jam. This album, yo. This album. Okay, hold on. Um, I'm gonna go pee, and I'll be right with you. Like, I didn't have to pee before this album. I have to pee now. <laughs> I'll, I'll be back. Ooh. Oh shit, I should probably look up the lyrics. Fudge sickles! Is this gonna fuck me up? Ah! Lyrics though. I knew before you told me you get it right, you memorized the lines of my thighs. This is only the third song too. Can we not, like, don't we really like gradually have to go down there? Like, <laughs> And you loved me like you promised your wife? Banks, is, are you dropping tea? Are you dropping tea? Do I know this person? Got a lot of It's a lot of love. The chorus? I'm... That is a very haunting chorus. This production. Wish I could change it, and we're always gonna be contaminated. Still not done either. What happened? We did you 
leave? Ah, I'm invested. I'm invested now. You can't just... I love how all of these songs, um, I can literally, till now, remember exactly what it was. Give me, remember exactly what it was. Contaminated, remember exactly how it, how it flowed, how it went. Like, that's really good for somebody who is just listening to your album. Like, I can, I remember the production of each and every track that is amazing to do that like even for a first listener you can go back and be like oh yeah I remember that track oh yeah I remember that track that's amazing so no wonder she has so much like electro in it it's electronic this time oh that's that's interesting to me because it's supposed to sound like this then again Sorry for anybody who already knew that. I'm just, I've literally avoided all interviews or everything about this album like it was a plague. I really wanted to sink my teeth into it and not even look up anything. <laughs> so, who? <laughs> Ooh, you tell me you're a book that I misread. I see you, Lyric. You tell me you're a book that I misread. I needed hydration. Let's keep listening. That was so different for her, but still the banks that I know, like, uh, also, I need a track called Beg For It by her. Um, if that's not a single that you were thinking about, Banks, please write it. Please, because I feel like you would make that single and it would, uh, it, you know what I'm saying? Beg For It. Just, oh. On a TV show, they'll have like a song that you know and you're like, ha ha, I knew that. I knew that. And that works perfectly with this scene. Stroke is one of those songs, I feel like. Oh my gosh, I hope, I, ooh, please somebody listen to this song and put it on a TV show that's popular and like send it through the stratosphere because they, this album is so good, but I feel like a lot of people probably have criticisms about this production, but um, this electro, like vibe of hers that that's what like makes me understand look what you're doing to me even more it flows right with the album but the problem is we heard two singles that are like on different sides of the album so like oh um i think it's ironic that she has a song has an album called goddess and then she has has a song called Goddess, and then she has a song called Godless. Probably nothing of, of relation, but like, I, th I think it's interesting how she's carrying on these god um, symbolisms with each album. Okay, like the altar, Goddess. Probably not. It's fine. <laughs> I 
haven't guessed the flow of any production yet and I'm I'm okay with it. I'm so okay with it. I feel it. You lay down next to whose side? I am godless. That hurt so damn good. I am oh god. Her lyrics hurt me so good. Oh, what am I gonna do? without another album soon like what am i gonna do with my life like you brought joy and happiness into my world for this split album for the split second in time maybe i just gotta leave i have liked every single song on this album so far What is this? Okay. That change up was something. I donate my love. I just want to die in. <laughs> Sorry, I can't wait to listen to this full on with my headphones. I can't I can't wait until that moment. Oh Lord. Okay. It's getting dark. Let me turn on my lights. We are about halfway through the album now. Oh, it has been a journey. Oh. Oh, I gotta compose it myself. Oh, Lord, help me get through this album. Mm. Mm. Okay. Okay. Which, everybody had a problem with this track because it's featuring the Francis and the Lights, but I've never heard of them. So I came in this, like, this is Banks. This is her new song. Um, I didn't have a problem with it. Um, I think a lot of people were... Eh, I don't think they hated the track necessarily. We all love Banks. But I think it's just because of the auto-tune was too much. But now that I've listened to the album, I understand it now. But um, I love this track. I love this track. Her voice... Gorgeous. It's, 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 ho, oh, oh. So, sorry if you don't like this track, you can, track you can skip. I will put the time down below in text so you can skip it, but, excuse me while I turn up a little bit. Mmm. 
I could also see that single being on a TV show or something like that when um, somebody's walking away from somebody and then she just comes in with that last chord I don't, and then just like tomorrow. Yesterday made me a fool today. Or, but you moving too fast on your daddy long legs. <sighs> you ever... I can't get over 2008. I literally, memories are so far embedded into my brain sometimes that I can literally go back to them and smell exactly what I smelled in that moment. Feel exactly what I felt in that moment. Look at the person and remember exactly what they were wearing. Because I can't let it go. Oh, okay. You think about our endings, but I think about when I met you, though. Okay, I need to go do it, so keep going. I'm just scared I'm going to end up alive. Oh, okay. Wow. I feel like that song, in all honesty, that song made me really sleepy. <laughs> but that's just because the background was so, like, just... It, it made me calm. It made me very calm. And that's not something I've been feeling since this album started. So, thank you for that break. I needed it. I need. I needed it. This Alaska. Oh. Oh, I guess the break's over. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Oh, that. This for such an interesting production but I have no idea what she was talking about <laughs> oh, I love that song though oh, ooh, that ooh, that build up <laughs> yes 
Love it. 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 I have not had a song that I do not like on this album. Same. I love this one. I can't save myself. I need help. Same. Same, same. Ooh. <gasps> Look in my mirror and that's messy hair. Ooh. Ooh. Come through with the lyrics. Make me go. Let Take me there. Banks always takes me there. Where am I? Well, you know, that's Alaska. Okay, cool. What's it like there? Oh. We gonna fuck this whole thing up. Nice. I'm gonna pause it, but her voice, when it gets up into those uh, high notes where her voice starts to crack. Oh, I would love to hear this track live. Propaganda. Oh, oh. That's how you're gonna come towards me? We're, that's how we're gonna begin, I guess. If this is not on a TV show, what are you guys doing? This would be... Messy hair. We don't care. Good God. What's in this? Her lyrics are literally like a page written out of a diary or 
just like her inner thoughts or something. It's just so tangible. I can feel it. I can taste it. I am there. I am experiencing it with her. Oh. You ever just like see one of those science videos where like this is how the world began and like you're going into somebody's eye and then it gets like really bright or something like that and then you like see everything from like how animals multiplied and humans began and started like you know teaching their children and everything like that and then they grew up and all that. that's literally what that sounds like it sounds like the world moving forward in time Just, just, just experience this with me. Experience it with me. Oh, Thank God. I can't do it. I can't do it. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, this got me tired. <laughs> I, oh. Again, I could literally look through every single one of these tracks and know exactly the way it sounded. She reverting back to just being a child. Oh. We got through it. We made it. We're here. We did it. My final thoughts. This is different than anything she's done before. If you were expecting the altar or goddess, this is going to be different. It is so hard for an artist to have bad actness and also having a side that is so tender. And Banks is very much like this. I feel like she has owned who she is now and she understands who she is better than anybody else. But she also has that side of her that is just maybe not sure or maybe it's hurting or um, in a relationship she shouldn't be in or why does she need this person or why does she always keep coming back to this person. I... I I just want to listen to the whole thing all over again. I have no bad tracks on that album. Some people might like one song better than the other, but I feel like she literally took us through everything she wanted to say. Um, one of the, I, I really like Hawaiian Mazes and then Alaska right after it. I think it's like hot and cold. It's like, okay, here's the album. This is me being hot. Now let's get cold. And I'm like, oh, God. 
Oh, it was, it was such a, oh, thank you, thank you, thank you for letting me react. Oh my God. I, I, I have no words. I have no words. I love the album. If you haven't listened to the album, go check it out. Stream it on Spotify. Stream it on Pandora. Whatever streaming place you have it or buy it. Please go buy it. Like, I... I, I need to go. All right. Thank you for watching. If you if you lasted this long while watching my reaction, good for you. Good. Ooh, we best friends. How about that? Uh, like this video. Uh, subscribe to my channel. Comment down below if you want to see any other reactions. And I will see you guys later. Bye.